dig this. Here we go. Morning, Ricky. Morning. Pretty cool morning. What did you say it was 59 degrees? Yeah, yeah something like that. Got a bit of a breeze, see the flag? So. Just before everybody gets up. Got some uh, unloading to do and prepping and... Get up gotta, attack and... Still got to buy a mission for the day Yep. Say the DA is pretty low, 2,000 feet lower than yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. So, we can go fast that. this morning. Yeah. One of our competitors is getting moving. All right, good morning. Okay, I got our first round of uh, time trials, one and only today. Uh, I got the car fully warmed up again to really hype, uh, help fight the cold. It's about 59 degrees or something. Yeah, DA and, is really low though for us, it's 1300. So we should have a good run. Yep. All right, get ready. All right, Ricky, how was your first time trial? Uh, had a decent light at 107 right away. Yeah. So, uh, 1626, uh, 60 foot. Sounds good, you hooked, Pretty yeah. Pretty typical one, and... For a cold track, I'm happy. A cold track, but with the DA down, we only went 1199.8. Uh, yeah, we didn't pick up like we thought. And went 109.8. Yeah, so I watched uh, some of our other competitors and they ran the exact same numbers as they did yesterday. So Even with the weather completely different. So it's, it's not probably, us. Might be a headwind too. There's a, a pretty strong headwind, yes. So that, that could be part of the reason, but yeah, I feel like we start getting this weather thing figured out and then it does it not, completely yeah. opposite of what it numbers say it should yeah. do. So, which means we don't have it figured out, but that's okay. We'll keep working at it. Yeah. All right, let's uh, get ready. It's probably going to be 11 o'clock oh, before we run oh, again. it's going to be a good while. Yeah, you'll have to take the car out and just drive it to get, get the heat back in it. Yep. It's a cold morning. It's not 60, I don't think. No. Yeah. All right. All right, we're up for the first round of uh, eliminations. And uh, still a pretty big field here today, so we got called up. But still quite a few cars yet to go. Uh, pretty much work on the tree, as always. And uh, we'll be getting to the next round. Hey Ricky, uh, yeah, not the way we wanted to finish our last uh, time up here, first round. Um, smile, it's not that bad. It's not the end of the world. It's a game. So, you had a decent light. I'm really proud of your lights. All weekend, your lights have been good. A 50 is not bad. So, you lost on the top end uh, part of the race, right? Yeah. Yeah. Same guy lost to yesterday because he had a four second jump on me. Hey, you had a good light for waiting for four seconds. That's that's something to be proud of. Uh, we will buy back, and we'll do our best, and it's not the end of the world. Yeah. Getting ready for Eddieville in two weeks. Eighth mile events. We're going to get our eighth mile game together before we head to No Name Nationals. Yep. And be ready to go. Your lights have been really good, so don't worry about it. 
All right, let's get this car ready to go. All right, guys, so we're going up for our uh, buyback around here pretty soon. Um, but we're going to be trying something a little bit different, two things, really. Uh, we're going to be running a 12.0. That's, you know, I've, we've done that before. But today, knowing our car can run faster, trying a little bit of the sandbag game, I guess. Uh, I agree, because I really got to try to work on my top end of the race and uh you know if i get around them sooner because i'm you know leaving sooner I'm really uh give that a try and we're also gonna drop pound in our tires we've been running 17 and a half pounds for well all season so uh i don't know if they're going away they're still hooking i don't think they are but it's it seems more sporadic it used to be a good 162 something 60 foot and now we're getting a lot more six three somethings. So they're not spinning, but getting a little more picky. So we're dropping a whole pound, going to 16 and a half pounds from 17 and a half. And uh, who knows? So potentially the last run of the season, why would we do that? Because we're going to Eddieville in two weeks, eighth right. mile event, and we're gonna see what if we can learn something before then. Right. So season everything that we can. This year's it is what it is, it's over basically. We'll do our best, of course, yeah. but we've got to race in two weeks. And if we go around doing it, then we go around doing it. Yeah, so how can he let it get us down? Let's uh, get ready and get up there. It's not the way we wanted to end our season, you know, um, not, not such a high note, but um, had some good lights this weekend, the whole weekend. We had good lights, and yeah. we're, we're proud of you. You found your spot on the, on the tree, and uh, that, that final race, that was, that was quite a race. Yeah, so uh, as you guys saw, uh, I dialed 12 0, and that was, that was just the number we decided on because we were just going to work on the top. Yeah, left a little bit, a little bit there. Yeah, and then uh, James, who uh, he's a venture champion. He, he won the championship this year. Yeah, locked it up with two He to go. had a 09, and because he ch dropped the tire pressure a pound, I think that really helped our 60 foot. Yeah. And so we had, if not our best, pretty close to our best 60 yeah, our second foot. Best ever. Any. Yeah. And uh, so I got out on him, plus I treated him. So I was by mid track around him, past the thousand foot, started looking. And I was on and off the gas because this car was our car was probably gonna run low 1190s. Right. So that with having the tree on him, uh, I was quite a ways out and feathering it. And yeah. yeah. But he, he's the master at that. He 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 doesn't hold back much and he he, he races straight up fair and square. But he's he's good at the top end. So right. it's it's hard to beat him. Uh, that's where he excels. So yeah. And we yeah. you know this entire weekend you know we just. Didn't didn't go, you know, I didn't back up the past weekend we had right. racing, but uh no we did learn a lot we did, of we did learn some things. We're gonna go to Eddieville in uh two weeks. Yep. Yep. So eight, eight mile race. Eight mile race, so uh, tune up for uh no name nationals and uh hope you're following us on that. And if not, uh like and subscribe and uh we'll uh see you at the next race. See you guys.